service above self being our motto the interact movement always endorses us with a desire to serve our fellow citizens us interactors have taken one step ahead in serving humanity during these tough times education indeed plays a major role in one's life and the culture of the country so today we the chairpersons of project intercede are here to tell you what intercede is what its objectives are and how it helps the community project intercede mainly focuses on the sustainable community development by facilitating the basic education for the future generation and our main objective of this project is to facilitate approximately six schools ranging from primary to senior secondary levels by fulfilling their key requirements After much search and deliberation, we chose six less privileged schools situated in the areas of Kegol and Avisavela. Namely, Yatiwala Kanishta Vidyalaya and Udapura Kanishta Vidyalaya, which are located in Derinigal Avisavela. Kegol Matra Sri Lanka Vidyalaya, Gantra Udagam Kanishta Vidyalaya, Gantra Khandapura Kanishta Vidyalaya, and Dampalpura Kanishta Vidyalaya, which are located in rural villages. will enhance not only the school's facilities but also the academic performances of its students nelson mandela once said education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world in 2020 there's a total of 10000 to government schools with a student population of 4.2 million despite this only a handful of schools are fully facilitated and are capable of providing a suitable learning environment for their students However, the opportunities for young children to broaden their knowledge and explore beyond the boundaries of a textbook are limited, especially in rural areas. We want every student to feel where we are today and expand their expectations for what they can achieve in life. In addition to improving the educational activities of students in rural and remote schools, it was a wonderful sight to see the children's excitement as they opened the bag to see what they had received. They all were wearing a sweet, innocent smile on their faces.